Good morning on Groundhog Day. 2015, snowing cats and dogs and elephants outside. It's supposed to blow about 50 miles an hour just to add insult to injury. That 50 miles an hour ought to move 16 inches of snow. Uh, we've continued working on the minnow, as you can see. The, uh, it's always hard upside down. The starboard facet of the new 5200 bottom has been sanded, flat and fared, and is ready for its first coat of uh, the barrier coat we will be using, Interlux 2000E. And John was going to take you through a little bit of what he's been going through. We always thought the premium filler was easy to sand, but this mahogany is like steel. We've never encountered mahogany like this. Go ahead, John. I've been sanding with 40 grit sandpaper. I sanded the other side cross grain with 40 grit, got rid of all the premium filler, uh, brought the boards down a little more even. We're leaving them a little bit off from totally flat because we want the boards themselves to show up as individual boards when it's finished. Um, I will be sanding for the next four hours on this with 40 grit sandpaper, then I'll straight grain it with 40, then I'll straight grain it with 60 and 80, and then we'll be ready for it. So, that's where we are on the 1930 Dodge Runabout, the Minnow. Uh, good news, her engine is back together in Michigan. The uh, first bench run will be today or tomorrow, followed by a break-in run. Uh, Robert Henkel will be running her for four to five hours. Make sure she comes up to temperature and all systems work. So, bye for now on the Minnow Project from Snake Mountain Boat.